Okay, party people. So, any case, I've got a little hole on top of my Pringles can, and I put a little hole on the bottom here. Okay, and so without further frost, I'm going to create some uh, hydrogen. So I'm going to take some some hydrochloric acid, and I'm going to pour it onto my uh, zinc. And the little H pluses are going to what? Pull electrons from my zinc, and the H pluses will grab electrons from the metal, and we'll create. Some gas. Okay, so I'm gonna pour. I'm gonna put this in here. I'm just pumping this up with some hydrogen gas, and I want to flood this this can with hydrogen. I want to make sure the entire can is filled up with hydrogen. Okay, and then I'm gonna light the little hole on top. Now the whole idea, party people, is that. I can light pure hydrogen because the hydrogen that's going to escape from the hand, remember, hydrogen is less dense than air. It goes up, correct? So I'll be, able, I'll be able to light this. But as I light it, once I pull the plug on the bottom here, air is going to be drawn up through the Pringles can. And at some point, when there's the correct stoichiometric ratio, and only then will the explosion occur. So I've created a lot of gas here, so I'm thinking that we're almost there, OK? Now, sometimes I light it, it happens right away because I didn't wait for it to flush, but I can feel I pushed out all the air and it should be full of hydrogen. And I don't know how much oxygen is soaked into a Pringles. I've never done it with a can in there. So I feel like I pushed enough gas here, okay? And you can see that this is the bubbling of gas here. Any case, I'm gonna guess because we're running out of time that we have flushed this with plenty of gas. Now, interesting enough, Okay, interesting enough. Uh, hold your ears because it could go right away. Okay, you see a little flame there. That little flame is going to dissipate. As I'm burning the hydrogen, I'm getting oxygen being pulled in the bottom. At some point when the air pulls up enough oxygen to hydrogen, we're going to get ourselves a little explosion. So when that flame dissipates, and the right stoichiometric ratio occurs. Oh, it's still there, the flame. Oh! <laughs> and there it goes. Have a great weekend. <laughs>